Now a question comes up all the time, is I've damaged my garage door, but it only seems to be one section of it. Can I just replace that one section? Well, to just replace that one section, you would need to know the manufacturer of that garage door. Otherwise, if you just went ahead and got any manufacturer, the color would never match. Now, why isn't the paint gonna match? Well, age-wise, it's not gonna match, right? Because it's probably somewhat faded. The other issue is every manufacturer has a different idea of what, what white actually is. They actually have a gray tone in their white paints. So depending on the manufacturer, it may have more or less gray in it. So you can understand if you took a different manufacturer's door, put the section in here, it's never gonna match. Plus the design of the door. Every manufacturer has a slightly different variance on their design, so nothing would ever line up or look right. Now another reason to change the section is, well, maybe you've just moved into home and your wife thinks, hey, it's too dark in here, can we get some windows? Well, unfortunately, probably not. Well, why not, Joe? Well, for the same reasons you can't just replace the panel or a section. The color's never gonna match, and the design won't match either. Unless you can figure out the manufacturer of the door, it's just never gonna look right. Now, some years ago when I purchased my home, I had a garage door without glass, and I just felt it was way too dark in the garage. So I figured, let me go up to the local home store, and when I'm, I'm gonna buy a glass section and everything will be great. Well, when I got up there, the representative looked at me like I was nuts. He already knew what I hadn't figured out yet, that there's no way you can just buy a glass section not knowing what type of door it is, slap it in there and hope it's gonna look right and work right. Now, I'm not gonna tell you it's impossible to change just one section in your door. If your door is fairly recent, well, it shouldn't be a problem. You can contact whoever installed it for you. They can tell you to manufacture your door, probably get you the section. Now, another way to identify the door is you may find a decal or a sticker on it, it has a serial number or a model number on it, tell you to manufacture your door, then you could use that to maybe go ahead and purchase a section and install that. Probably come out just fine. Some other information you'll need about the section is, well, how wide is it? And you're also gonna need to know how tall it is. Now these sections vary when they're steel anywhere between 18 inches and 21 inches in height. And then in width, well, they can be eight, nine, 16 feet long. If you can't figure out who installed your door, what manufacturer it was, you can't find any identification on stickers, serial number, model numbers, well then, all I can do is recommend you a new door. There's no way without that information that you're gonna be satisfied with the result. Now, I hope this video helped you out. Whether you're gonna replace your section or purchase a new door, you can give us a call here anytime. We'd be glad to help you out. Joe, did you get those windows replaced? No, we're gonna have to get a new one. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, press the like button. If you wanna learn more about garage doors and garage door openers, subscribe to the link below. I'm Joe Conti with Precision Door, a name you can trust.